wanted to uh, show you a couple of ways to splint a pelvic fracture. For a little while, these were considered um, an excellent thing to do. Some of the evidence now is showing that maybe this is not as good as what we thought, uh, but currently we're still, still using these. This poor guy has broken his pelvis. Obviously, you'd want to do this with a partner or two. I don't have one with me right now, so it's just going to be me. You're going to have to pretend with me that I have a partner. This is the Sam Pelvic Split and a very easy device to use. It really is designed for two people, um, but you're going to slide it underneath their lower back typically, or you can come up from underneath their legs. And that might be easier on this mannequin. But you'd want to minimize the movement of the patient. Find the um, wings of the pelvis. Gently lift them. And then it has this strap. You need two people to do this ideally. I'm going to try it with just one. But one person provides the counter um, by pulling on the orange strap while you pull on the black strap to you hear a click and that engaged there we go engage that then you velcro this in place and that stabilizes the pelvis very simple to use if you don't have one of these an old medic showed me this is you can take a sheet with the same idea i'm going to fold it till it's about as wide as the the uh, pelvis And again, slide it underneath them so it gets up under the, the pelvis. And with a partner, that would be much easier and a whole lot less movement. At this point, you take it and you cross it. And each of you can pull until you get it snug and tight. You can even try wrapping it almost like you would a tourniquet a time or two to get that snugger on there and then tuck it underneath, tape it down, secure it, and that helps to stabilize the pelvis. My experiences have been using this, even the, the sheet, because I've had pretty good luck with it. My fractured pelvic patients have really um, had good pain relief with it. Again, just my experiences, but these are a couple of things we can do to help stabilize the pelvis.